Subscribe to our channel and press the bell icon to never miss an update. Your ability to listen and your ability to articulate both are important. The political leaders who has to be good in rhetorics, the business leaders have to be a very good listener. Many other sectors, B school admission has also seen a vast change in this pandemic ridden world. B schools had to shift overnight to make sure learning continues and the management stressed on the smooth transition to the online world. Almost a year later, we are now at a stage where fresh batches are being inducted and acing virtual interviews are at the top of the mind for many aspects. To tell us more about some strategies to crack the virtual B school interviews, uh, we today have Professor Sayan Banerjee, who is the admissions coordinator at IMT Nagpur. To begin with, you know, what would be the most important focus factors while, you know, selecting candidates virtually as compared to the earlier physical setup? Whether it is a virtual or a physical form through which we are conducting interviews to select candidates, our parameters would not change. The predominant want is, of course, a matter of the attitude, intelligence, overall personality, an X factor that no one actually can put a, a word to describe. But, you know, it's like you know when you see one. Suppose you are not selected in our institute after so much of hard work and so much of uh, uh, preparation and all, you don't hear from us and you don't hear from anyone else. What's your plan B? Now, the answer most of the people provide is rehearsed answer that I'll prepare, etc, etc. But there is a fraction of second of change in the expression in the face of the candidate. That shows that person's ability to take a situation, what we say, taking it to the cheat, you know, taking the blow on the cheat. That okay, something bad happens, let's move on. That fraction of seconds of change in the body language shows the kind of personality we are dealing with. That is part of that X factor, you know. You, you can't train a person to do that. You, you can't fake it. it. It comes naturally. According to you, what are the some of the major drawbacks or some of the most uh, advantages points of remote interviews that students as well as you know organizations can look at one important element of selection that group activity or a group discussion that generally happens as an integral part of the pi process that's not very easy to conduct online candidates who may have a poorer network correction may lose out on an important aspect of articulating his or her point participating, contributing in the discussion because of constant disruption in the internet connectivity. So keeping that in mind, uh, a lot of B school, including ours, we this year have not continued with that important part of the selection process that is group discussion. However, we are trying out alternatives. While we are conducting the personal interview, we are giving them some sort of a, a thought experiment. That suppose you are in a team and you have these team member X and Y, X is good in that and Y is good in this. And if you have to recommend one of them for the promotion for the next level, who would you promote and why? That kind of thought experiment, that kind of response from the candidate gives us an understanding of how the person consider what is fair, what is not so fair, what is the value judgment the person has for the students i think they are in a more comfortable condition to face the pi process because see they are doing it from the comfort of their home and i think in a way it's good because we are able to see the better side of their personalities not the side of their personality where they are fumbling because they're nervous not because they don't know there are pluses and the minuses as you rightly pointed what are the kind of uh, tips or strategies would you like to uh, recommend for upcoming virtual selection process that's uh, going to be there, that's already happening in some B schools that is going to happen for Amtinakpur also? Uh, what do you think will 
make the cut for these students in the family so it is very important as a preparation part or as a run up to the interview that the candidate make sure that the pi personal interview takes place when the person has a very good internet connectivity and for some reason there is one or two seconds of drop and the question is not properly heard by him or her and therefore it is half understood i would advise that please don't try to start giving an answer to it if you have not understood the question well the other important attribute is that because the interview is being conducted remotely through internet and all and you are sitting in your uh, study or you are sitting in your bedroom or whatsoever should not give you a permission to appear casual about the whole exercise and that includes your attire your body language your alertness everything mr banerjee along with the the connectivity issues that students might be facing or the administration might be facing there is another uh, challenge of you know maintaining the interactivity between the two people that is a very challenging factor we have been doing digital shoots for a while now and we understand that it's very difficult and different for us as individuals to talk to you know a, a person who is in the window who is not in front of you whose body language you are not very familiar with how they are reacting you are not very familiar with in certain situations if i may ask you you know three things absolutely you should keep in mind to ace your virtual interview one you should come across as a savvy with the technology that is being used okay that is important because we are at a tipping point of our business and the business model where technology is going to be more important than ever second is your ability to listen and your ability to articulate both are important the political leaders who has to be good in rhetoric the business leaders have to be a very good listener they have to listen to their uh, bosses they have to listen to their subordinate they have to listen to their investors they have to listen to their customers and everyone and third is a body language that shows a certain level of comfort and relaxation without appearing casual professor banerji as uh, admissions coordinator at imd nagpur how prepared do you think uh, you are at this moment for conducting these virtual interviews uh, we have been talking about the kind of skills that students need what are the qualities they they have to display uh, i would like to know how uh, imd nagpur is looking at this we have been extremely thorough and we have double check triple check we did dry runs we found all the possible loops and bugs and loopers and bugs and everything that is within the control of as far as the technology is concerned that because it's a remote uh, interview process and therefore some exercises like uh, as i said group exercise and all would not be there this time but we will replace them with some innovative creative ideas and we will maintain the parameters of selections as rigorous as thorough as they have always have been professor banerjee thank you very much for your time uh, being honest is the key word i think from this conversation that i have uh, gotten and i think uh, people who are watching it will also somehow relate themselves with it and try to be as honest as possible you know when they are appearing for the virtual interviews this time around and i hope that uh, you get to meet these students very soon on campus uh, and have a buzzing campus life that you always had been thank you very much yes. again